What is going on guys? Today we're back with another video. I came across a really cool music video today and it's uh, by Quinn92 and Logic. It's called A Letter to My Younger Self. And in that video, there's this really cool effect that I wanted to try out today. Or I guess it's called, a, I wanna call it like a stop motion effect. Anyways, I thought we could try that today and see if we can create that effect using Premiere Pro 2020. I'm outside today in my backyard and we're, I'm gonna try to replicate some of the movements that are shown in that music video today. So let's get started. Uh, throughout the whole music video, Logic and Quinn are literally just like walking around town. It looks kind of boring whenever you take all the graphics away, but once you put all the graphics in, like how I'm gonna show you later on in this video, it looks pretty cool. So you can see here that I'm just walking around and I'll be uh, and I'll be doing different scenes of just random stuff to make it more interesting. All right, so I was w trying to watch the music video to see how they approached uh, doing the effect and Honestly, from what I could tell, they literally just took screenshots of just a random frame in the in the video and they copy and pasted it into the video. It's hard to explain, just watch. <laughs> I don't know why I even knew that it would probably work, but I still somehow surprised myself with how well that actually looked. Um, I really believe that they actually just screenshotted the video and placed it in. <laughs> That's so funny. Um, well, without further ado, I'm just gonna do the rest of the scenes and uh, we'll look at the last result. Today we're going to be harnessing 